Hi you guys, we are Nath and Hannah and we are in Norway on the Disney Magic! We have previously been sailing around the stunning Norwegian fjords stopping off at these three ports Islesund, Nordfjord Eid and Eidsfjord We have had an absolute blast so far so why not join us in this video to explore our fourth and final port day in Stavanger Morning. Good morning. We're at the start of the Pulpit Rock Trek, four kilometres to the top. And it took about 45 minutes to get it from Stravinger, didn't it? It did, yeah. We was up bright and early, up at half five, and then we went to the Disney Theatre, didn't we, to have our little meeting with everybody yeah. before we got on the coach. And then, yeah, and now it's to get here, so we're on our way up. Yeah, let's go. So I don't know where Knife is, I think I've lost him. He's caught up in the crowds, but my competitive size so coming out this morning, the coach driver said the record time to get up to Pulpit Rock is 45 minutes. So I want to see how close to that we can get, but it's a real busy trial to be fair. So we'll see. There you are. You got lost in the crowds. Here I am. <laughs> Absolutely blind. Knife keeps getting stuck behind the crowds. I think I'm small enough just to squeeze past people. <laughs> About a mile in there, got one and a half miles left for the top. How are you feeling? All right, yeah, I warmed up a bit now in my little shirt for jacket. Yeah, my legs didn't want to work this morning, but... You're all right now, I'm all right now. Awesome. <laughs> Somewhere up there, where we're heading for. Absolutely stunning. Look at that. Oh man, I'm ringing wet. I know. I know. Have I been pushing you? Yeah, it's flattening out now though. <laughs> the wind's picked up now. It's calling my pits down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah we just on this big Do you know what's fueling us? Mickey waffles. We had, we had two puddings last night. We were the only people on the table to have two puddings. But I think it's fueling us this morning. Yeah, and, and, a, and a big breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, the views up here though, they're absolutely epic. They really are. Yeah, I can't wait to get to the, to the top. Yeah, the further we've got up this uh, mountain climb as well, the less people there's been. Yeah. So it's pretty good now because we're not in the bottleneck of it all. Yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, it's real cool. Do you know what? It's almost like got a bit of Canada. Even though we haven't really been to Canada apart from Niagara Falls, but... Yeah, it's what you see on the TV, isn't it? Yeah, it's got like a Canada feel to it, hasn't it, I think? Yeah, definitely. 600 metres to go now to the summit of Pulpit Rock. So we've made it to the top of Pulpit Rock. Yeah, we made it in just over an hour, didn't we? And even though it's busy, we was a bit worried about this being too touristy. But even though there is a lot of people, the views are absolutely stunning. Like there's no amount of people that can take that away from this place, is there? Yeah, and literally you are just like on the edge and it's so windy, it just it gets the <laughs> adrenaline going, doesn't it? It does, I don't think we've ever been on top of like a mountain that's like such a sheet chewed rock. Yeah, it just feels a bit dangerous. But look, honestly, it's just like a painting, isn't it? Like, it yeah. doesn't even look real. Oh my god. I'm so glad we did this. Yeah. Happy six year anniversary. Happy six year anniversary. Six more years to go. 
How many more? <laughs> Not just six. Quite below. <laughs> yeah, what a great way to spend the day and, and to top the cruise, cruise off as well. I know we've got tomorrow at sea, but last day on Norwegian land. And this has beat my expectations for Pulpit Rock, to be fair. Yeah, mine too. Yeah. yeah. It's been a lot better than I expected. Yeah, fantastic. So glad we uh, were quite quick at hiking, because look at the queue now for a photo. <laughs> There's literally like five people when we got up here. Everyone's up here now. <laughs> it's like Mount Snowden in Covid days. <laughs> As the shepherd says to the sheepdog, let's get the flock out of here. Bye, Pulpit Yeah, bye. Now and we were sweating, wasn't we, on the way up here? And you know, like you've got cold, damp sweat. That's. But I need to get warm. Just, uh, just share that bit of information with you all. Oh, well, that's better. We've come down quite a bit. We're quite sheltered now, and it's still a little bit windy, but I can feel my fingers again. Yeah, it went really cold until the. Yeah, if it's just in one of them modes, yeah, right, we've got to descend and get sheltered. Yeah, I'm warm. I wish you had your white trainers. Yeah, I could do with some white trainers right about now. We're just briefly uh, passing through Nepal. The, the views of the fjords, Amazing. every corner, there's another view and it's just absolutely stunning. Stunning. Okay, for anyone that might have come across this for a bit of information, and like us, you worried about it being a bit busy, a bit touristy, uh, just do it. Yeah, we've had such a great, great hike, and the, the path is actually quite challenging. It's not a mega easy path. It's, it's been an epic day, hasn't it? Yeah, it's been awesome. Yeah, we do like to go on these hikes and just go out there and, and just be us. But at the same time, the pulpit rock for us, we kept looking at the image and it's just such, it just draws you to it. It's just such a popular image for when you're researching traveling in Norway, isn't it? It is, and we booked it with Disney because we did knock into doing it ourselves, but it was just too difficult, wasn't it? To sort of get here and get back. And obviously we're limited, aren't we, on time because of when the ship leaves. So that's what we've done this one trip with Disney. Yeah, and we still got the epic photos. Yeah, we have. <laughs> Nearly there now. Nearly. 650 meters. The last pushback down to the car park and we made it onto the coach before the rain came. After an amazing last port day we set sail heading back to the UK. And there's no doubt that the excitement got a bit too much for someone. Thank you. Okay. We'll get this. Oh. I love you Pluto! <laughs> Talking about excitement, join us in two weeks from now when we will show you all things Disney magic. Yeah guys, we have been saving the best until last as we cover what we get up to on our days at sea aboard this incredible ship. So if any of you guys are Disney freaks like us, then you are in for a right treat. See you next time. Bye. Yeah, we got the world record for the most attempts on the aqueduct on uh, Disney magic.